My time at JC, IJC was most influenced by my football coaches, teammates, and a teacher team. Uh, the reason I'm, I was here was because Tom Childs recruited me in 1972 to play football for Dudley Miller. Well, I came, but Tom left, so left me playing with Dudley and, and uh, of course, the famous tennis coach here today, Paul Johnson, and well, Larry Hancock, I think, was our third coach. Uh, as far as football, I think that would have been my main objective for coming to IJC, even though I did get an education to go with it. I want to thank Tom Childs for recruiting me to play football 46 years ago. The people I have the privilege of playing football with have turned into some of the greatest men and friends I know of. Off the friends, some of my time at IJC was spent in the classroom. My favorite teachers ended up being one of my greatest friends as an adult. Thank you, Ms. Nan Comer, for making five days a week at eight o'clock in the morning a little less painful. Without IJC, I wouldn't have met my wife who gave me four children and a bunch of grandchildren. I ended my time at IJC with a course in HVAC that put me on the path to where I am today. I'm thankful to IJC for giving me the opportunity to attend college and foster friendships and memories that have lasted a lifetime. In 1978, and started my own company. I really came up here just thinking I was probably gonna just do service work, because that's really what I was, was a service technician for Scott and Sons before I moved up here. So, started doing what things, just one thing led to another, and, and back then I had a lot of energy, and I, 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 I still thank the Lord for giving me a strong, strong back because I couldn't have done it without a strong back. But I would work probably 16 hours a day, seven days a week a lot of times, to get my company up and going. And when you start a new company, you really don't have anything but a price. You don't have a reputation, so you just have a price. So you're working for nothing. You're about to starve to death trying to feed your children. But if you hang in there and if you're honest, I really believe anybody will make it if they work hard and be honest. I think honesty is the most important thing you can have when you're in business. Well, when I came to ICC on, on a sports scholarship that they gave me because I would not have been able to come without it, I just thought since I had that opportunity and IJC had given me that opportunity, I just wanted to give back to someone to give them the same opportunity that I had that wasn't fortunate enough maybe to have to be able to play a sport or something and get their college paid for. So that's the reason we started the endowment. I just want to thank uh, the person that thought enough of me to nominate me for this award. I'd like to thank the alumni board for thinking that I'm worthy to receive this award. I'd like to thank Dr. Allen for having this for someone every year. I'd like to thank my family for putting up with me for all these years. And thank all the friends that I've uh, come close to through Little One with Jimmy College.